Good morning. Sunday morning here. And um, I woke up and I just needed to go to Walmart right away. Um, haven't cleaned up or anything. Just uh, put some warm clothes on. Uh, it's like 49 degrees here. In my van it's 57. So it's really cold. And if you've been following my uh, videos, um, I'm loving it. <laughs> yeah. I'm absolutely loving it. Um, if you're new here, um, I live full-time in my minivan, and I have for three years now. Um, I'm a city mouse and a country mouse, but mostly a city mouse, um, you know, the past few months. Okay, so I went to Walmart. The reason that <laughs> I haven't even combed my hair yet um, is because uh, I want to show you what I bought. And I can't put it away and start cleaning up until I show you. And I know you guys love this Walmart thing. so um, And so do I. You know, I used to watch them too. I was like, ooh, what did they buy? And a lot of things, I went and bought them. You know. So, first, first. I like more artesian bread. And this is, let's get it right here. This is garlic sourdough bread. And it's it's, it's uh, got substance to it. I don't know if I'll eat all of this, but you know, um, the last couple of videos I've been talking about this park, and uh, it's like you share, and so I've got some bread to share. Somebody brought some bread that was like Wonder Bread, and it was all like, much. I said, hold on, I got some rye bread. So then everybody ate it, so I um, had to get some more bread, but I couldn't find some good rye bread. Now, why am I back at this park again? Actually, I did try a couple of new parks. What I did, because it's early, it's 8 o'clock and it's early, so I um, bookmarked a couple of different parks with Google Maps. So, Because this morning I was kind of like looking, okay, where are some more parks? Because, you know, I kind of seen this one. Um, I went to one of them. It took me near downtown. Well, no, I actually went to two parks. One of them took me near, near downtown. And it said it was this really nice big park. But it was downtown. I was like, huh? <laughs> yeah. So it was really good, though, because I got to see downtown. I kind of drove downtown. And in all honesty, it reminded me of downtown Tucson. It really did. The, the, small, the, the size of it. And some of the shops and the way it looked when I was looking down the streets, it's like, oh my gosh. And you know, when I came into Reno, um, it kind of, with the mountain ranges around and the size of it, uh, it reminded me of Tucson a little bit. And, but that's why I was so surprised. Is there's only three, 3,500 um, people uh, living here. It looks so much bigger. I guess that's why they call it, I think, I'm going to guess that, I think they call it the biggest little city in America. Yeah. Um, it is a small city. <laughs> I can because Tucson has over a million. Not much over, but they have a little bit over a million. So this is almost like a third of it. So, okay, so I did check out the park, and I'm like, mm, you know, no, this isn't what I had in mind. So then I drove quickly to another one, wasn't too far, and it was really small too, but they said it was like this really nice walking park, and it was like this neighborhood park, and I thought, well, I did like the feel of this park, so um, I'm back, and I'm going to walk and exercise, and uh, I've been doing a lot of exercising on my blanket like I was in Tucson, but I can really go for it longer because it's cooler here. I'll tell you, my muscles are sore. I am really getting good exercise. I did, I've talked about Planet Fitness quite a bit. I'll get to the groceries in a minute. I, these things are on my mind. I talked about Planet Fitness from day one. Well, when I was in Tucson, I did look up um, Planet Fitness uh, in Reno. And they said they weren't open. Well, thus they have opened. And so what I did in Tucson, because that's where my membership is, I figured since I'm here, I got I to gotta cancel because um, I didn't even know if these were going to be open in Reno. And, you know, how would I cancel? You have to cancel in person. You really do. 
So I canceled. Now I do have Planet Fitness until the 22nd, but, um, but that's okay. Actually, I've only gone a couple times since I went once in Las Vegas and then once here. It just seems like I am getting, I have learned to get my exercises without Planet Fitness. The only thing I want from Planet Fitness at this point is parking and showers. But the showers are closed. They're open in Tucson, but not in Nevada. So, you know, uh, yeah. So today, I know it's really cold. I might wait till it warms up a little bit in a, in a couple days to wash my hair. It's not that bad, you know. Uh, yeah, it's not that bad. But um, so what I might do next couple of days is put it in braids and it, it kind of makes it better. So there's my thinking. I want to uh, give you an update on Planet Fitness. I've canceled my membership. Um, if, if they open up the showers, I will restart the membership here in Reno. So, okay. Onward. Onward and upward. Some of these are repeaters. I got orange juice. That I'll put in my um, overflow, the big bin. Actually, it's right there. Yeah, it's my overflow. And then those are my two bins there. I use them. This is where my um, passenger seat would have been. And I have three bins. Those are two small, and this is one large. And they make great tables while I'm driving and just tables. And then these, I'm going to keep up with this. The cranberry juice. I'm going to keep this up. This really, it's really saved my butt. Yeah. Back in Tucson. Because I was starting to feel sick again. I was like, oh no. And with the COVID thing going on, I don't want to step my foot in a hospital or in a urgent care or anything. So. Cranberry. I know my son, she goes, well, mom, why don't you go? And I'm like, I didn't even have time to explain. And it's like, well, because... I don't, you know, want to go into any facility. And I got two of these. Walmarts are kind of the same, but there's these little differences. So when I'm in a new town, I kind of hit a Walmart and I kind of look through. Um, and I do love these. They're great value. And they're these crackers. They're $1.88, I believe. Yeah. yeah. But the I love rosemary. I do. And uh, my mom always cooked with rosemary. And her spaghetti, her spaghetti was runny. Yeah, it was, I don't make runny spaghetti, but she did. But you know what? Uh, she put in so much rosemary that, ooh, I love it. I think it gained the uh, love of rosemary. I got two of them because I can't find them very often. And I'll put them in my overflow. When I see something that I really like, and I'm in a different city, it's like, ooh, let me get a couple of these. What else did I get? Oh, well, today, today I'm going to make a, a really nice sandwich. Just one. It's going to be lunch. It'll probably really fill me up, so I won't eat much more of that. But I'm going to really do it. I'm going to do it nice. If I'm not eating very much, what I do eat, then I want it to be really special. So I'm going to kind of deli me out today. Um, I've got, uh, these are like, like, it was only like a dollar twenty. Um, for the sliced, for sandwich slices, pickles. They're not the best tasting, but they're pretty good. Um, it saves money. I don't go high end, but I don't like to go too low end. Um, I was out of this. This was only, this is usually $1.23. It was like a dollar, a dollar eight or something. I was like, wow. Um, I used to get mild because it's just easier on my tummy. Salsa, salsa. And there, I always pick up a couple of the chicken, 98 cent chicken, really good. It's really good chicken for 98 cents. And it's perfect for one meal. They have, why am I, I'm showing you the scan, I'm going to scan it, yeah. <laughs> Oopsie. Yeah, chicken, yeah. They do have the larger can, it's about this size, oh, it's about like this size. And it's the exact same price. If these are 98, um, the chicken, the bigger size is like double that. But it's hard to um, eat all of that. Once you open it, it's like you got to eat it. See, that goes there. Okay. Not too much more. You know these. Yeah. 
not too much more. You know these. This is, let me, because I usually take them out of the package. Let me show you what they look like. That's what they look like. It's just, let's show you. It's just a perfect little, you, you peel it back, and then you've got a uh, cheese, a uh, soft cheese dip. It's, it's great. Yeah. Love it. And then, um, because they had a lot, I was like, ooh, I'm going to pick up a couple. So, yeah. Well, you know what these are? Honey crisp. Actually, I'm down to one. Can you believe that? I've been eating a lot of apples. I didn't want to get more um, until I actually ran out. I have one more. So, I've got, I got like, I got ten of them. Ten apples. Yeah. And onion for my sandwich, a sweet onion. Got an onion for my sandwich. Yeah, I'm going to do this up the deli style mustard and mayo. And, um, and then of course, where is it? You know, I love me Swiss cheese. <laughs> yeah. I got the slices too. I think it'll be easier. And then with the, I'm thinking I'm going with slices right now. I got extra sharp for slices because I got the bread. I might as well for the next few days. Now this I got. I don't know because it's cooler here. I think it'll last longer. I got some um, butter. I like butter for things. You know I've got that one pancake mix in here. And I just think it'd be good to, to, to actually make it, uh, instead of oil, put butter. And I can put butter on top of it and just eat the, without syrup. Um, I always like to key, have three of these, and I only have one left in there. My creamers. They had a lot of this, too. Sometimes I've been finding some of the, um, Walmarts don't have these. It's just, you know. It's kind of junk food, but it's fun to eat. Sometimes I'm just sitting back here. I want something to munch on. Um, <laughs> limes. Put the lime in the coconut. <laughs> what is that song? You put the lime in the coconut. Um, I love limes. You know I love limes. What do I do with my limes? Um, I do have a, a one and a half cucumbers in here, and I know the because it was so cool. I know the the half cu cucumber is pretty good. Uh, it might be a little dried out, but yeah. Um, I put, I cut the lime in half, and then I squeeze it over my apples and over any of uh, the fresh produce, and um, or sometimes I put it if I open my salsa, I'll put it put a dip a little bit of salsa for, so I can dip it and I put some um, lime in there to make it really taste really Mexican food because uh, the Mexicans use the limes um, and plus I'm getting my uh, pure vitamin C doing it so Ooh, these are just old standbys yeah. two Romas That's it. Wow. Okay, so that's it. Um, uh, that is my uh, Walmart cash, and I wanted to share it with you. So there'll be more to come. Um, I know, I always, my eye, maybe videotaping makes my eye itch. My hands are clean, though. You know, I, I have, I did find a little thing of um, hand sanitizer, the regular, and this is a little bottle. I found it, so I've got it in my... Um, the, the door slot of my driver's side. So as soon as I get out of Walmart, I, I do it and do my steering wheel. But what I do back here, when I'm back here, this is just, I mean, this is just liquid. What I do is this is um, water with tea tree oil in it. And I know it's probably, you know, it's just liquid. And I just, yeah. tea tree oil. It smells good too. I do that back here a lot. So, you know, clean my hands quite often. I'll leave that right there. Okay. See ya.